News from the world of aviation where Australia's Qantas is preparing for international travel with countries with high vaccine rates to resume in December, sending shares higher as it reported narrower annual loss of $1.26 billion. Airline, which grounded its global fleet in March last year due to closed borders, said it planned to bring back five of its 12 Airbus A330 Super Jumbos by mid next year to fly to the US and Britain a year earlier than previously forecast. It is hopeful sign for travel in the Asia-Pacific region where borders are largely closed and international travel is 95% below pre-COVID levels. The Qantas plan is dependent on government decision as well. The airlines earlier said it would require all of its employees to be vaccinated against COVID-19 as part of its broader commitment to safety, in line with some other airlines globally. We on now available in your country. Download the app and get all the news on the move.